Okay, this is the second time I made this video. I know you guys usually I make them and I don't watch them again, but I felt like I'm not explaining what I want to say correctly. And this should have been a closet confession, but it was just on my heart to do it right now. Um, the verse on my heart today that God just keeps on pounding in me is, Seek ye first the kingdom of God and his righteousness, and then all these things will be added unto you. And I realized last week that I wasn't seeking him first. I was seeking um, things that aren't bad, but it was giving me anxiety because I wasn't going after him first. I wasn't clinging to him. And I hope you understand what I'm saying and don't misinterpret what I'm trying to say. But like last week, like I just could not get up my mind. I want to lose these pounds. I'll lose these pounds. That's all I could think about. It was just like, you know, obsessing with me. Well, I know how to lose them, but I have a hard time getting consistent and being dedicated. So whatever. And like, I want to get tan and I want to, I want to, um, do this and that and the other. And it's just, you know, that's not the main thing. That's not the main thing. I am to seek him first. And here's my point. In my mind, I was thinking if I could lose these pounds and if I get tan, then I won't feel so blah. Okay. We seek him first. The kingdom of God. What is the kingdom of God? It is joy, peace, and righteousness in the Holy Ghost. My joy does not come from my tan or how much weight I lose. My joy comes from him, and I seek him first above everything else. Not for what he can give me, but to know him more. Okay, does that make any sense to anybody? If we are seeking other things, we're seeking you know, we can't wait for this vacation. That's whenever we'll, you know, be all excited. And when we lose this weight and when we get tan and when we do this, that, and the other. But our joy comes from seeking him first. That is a joy that's unreplaceable. It's not based on happenings. It's based on knowing him and seeking him. And I just realized that I was trying to do a lot of things in my own flesh and not just really just, you know, giving it to him and finding my joy in him. I mean, like I really was thinking last week, like, I'm so tired. I'm so blah. I just, until I lose this weight and until I go get tan, I'm just going to feel like this. No, that's not true. And I think with the world we live in, we can get that way. Um, I really don't need any critiquing or telling me that, <laughs> that I should be happy with how I am. I know that. Okay. I, I know that. I'm just putting this out there that if anyone else gets in their moods, then to remember, we are to seek Him first in His kingdom. Joy, peace, and righteousness in the Holy Ghost. Knowing who we are in Him, knowing how much He loves us, and knowing that there's nothing that compares to being in His presence. Nothing. No vacation, no tan, no job, no body figure, no marriage, no kids. Nothing compares to knowing Him. Okay?